There is a new way for school resource officers to get around campus at Fountain Fort Carson High School. The e-bikes are made for uh, ease of mobility for the officer and quickness of response. These bikes go over multiple types of terrain. They're very, very fast. They're maneuverable, uh, and they allow us to get from one side of the campus to the other side of the campus extremely fast and safer than responding quickly in our patrol car. It'll probably cut off at least a minute or so of response time. Officer Stage has been trained to ride the school's newest e-bikes. We go up to uh, Colorado State College um, in Colorado Springs. It's a week-long training. Basically, they go over the mechanics of the bike, they go over balancing of the bike, what the bike is made for and what it is not made for, what obstacles it can go up, around, vehicles, we'll go upstairs, we'll maneuver downstairs, uh, we'll do high speed slides so we can uh, uh, apprehend or, or block suspects from victims, things like that, and then we'll culminate the week with a uh, 40 to 50 mile training run. Officer Stage says the students seem excited about the new addition. I think a lot of the students that have seen it, they were like, oh, that's really cool, you know, big fat tires and, and things like that. Uh, and of course, it has a light on it and stuff like that. I think one of the things that kind of draws attention to it the most is just the aggressive tires. It just makes it look cool, you know. And uh, uh, who wants to ride equipment that doesn't look cool, right? Yeah. So but these e-bikes are really, really cool. They like the shape. They like the tires. Um, they like the speed of it and things like that. They thought it was pretty fun. Officer Stage is grateful for this opportunity. You know, I just wanted to thank our department and our leadership and our, SO le our SRO leadership and the school leadership that allowed us to, uh, to get these bikes. I think it's going to be very, very monumental for the, the surrounding agencies. I think it's going to set a great precedent, but it also allows us, like I said, to respond quickly for our citizens and our student. And that's what's more, most important to us is we want to get there safely, but we want to get there to help somebody.